Western Artillery Space r and Well, today we have a Triumph tractor block in the uh, thermal cleaner. It's out of a Morgan. Um, this is, in fact, a tractor block that was used uh, for the Triumph, for the Morgans, and some other stuff over from the UK. And we wanted to show you what this was like because um, we're going to take and clean it up a bit. Uh, the outside isn't too terribly crusty on this. It is oily. But um, what you're going to see here is there's an awful lot of calcium deposits on the inside of the block where the water jackets are. And if you take a look down here, you can see it's uh, that is pretty crusty. So we're going to put this in for about an hour and then we'll take it out and show you what's going on with this. And then we'll put it over the blaster. All right, where well, our block is. Uh, in the toaster oven here and as you can see things have uh, gotten dried out real well got some little bit of ash left on there and you can kind of see how our calcification has all turned uh, a different color now now that it's been heated up, you can actually see it kind of starting to flake off in there. Which means it should come off pretty well in the blast. And the same thing over here, just a bunch of ash. Alright, we'll go ahead and put it in the blaster over here, and then we'll come back to it again. Well, okay, here we are after about 15 minutes of blasting. As you can see, the... Uh, Inside of the cylinders came nice and clean. All the calcification is gone. That's always a good thing to get rid of that. And as you can see, the exterior of the block came out real nice. As did the interior. over here it came out real nice as well anyway uh, thermal cleaning is the way to go on your engine block if you're going to have it clean it certainly does a much better job than any of the liquid cleaners that are out there so if you have more questions about this give me a call here at Coast Mesa R&D we'll see you soon